prototype for a design I call the Electron, based on the Electra distortion that a lot of uh, pedal builders, uh, particularly Love Pedal, have uh, used as the basis for their designs over the years. Um, this is basically using a bunch of parts, values, and everything to make it uh, sound similar to a cranked up tweed amp uh, that's on the verge of uh, you know, blowing up. Whether or not it actually sounds like that in real life, uh, you'll have to decide for yourself but I think it does sound good. Uh, right now I'm playing my Strat into a Blackstar HT Club 40. Here's the clean sound. Uh, like it takes uh, your, uh, you know, how hard you pick uh, very well. with your guitar volume and tone controls. Like, it, that's just, uh, you know, a really nice sparkly clean sound with the volume of my Strat turned down just, you know, you know just a little bit. Compare that to the volume of my Strat at uh, 10 with this off. Still nice sounding, but not as... Uh, not as glassy and... Like, this is one of those pedals that... Uh, at its core could really be used as, uh, you know, an always-on thing if you just like, you know, riding your volume knob to get to different, uh, different levels of gain and whatnot. Um, as you can see, it has three controls. There's a volume control, which, because this pedal doesn't actually have too much output uh, volume in its current incarnation, you'll probably want to have uh, cranked up most of the time. <laughs> It's all the way up, it's, uh, you know, usually more than unity, so it's enough. Um, and because it's a single transistor circuit, uh, the amount of gain you have dialed in, that's the gain knob. Like you could dial it back a bit. Just to make things a little less harsh. But that does affect uh, your overall output as well. Um, so most of the time you want to keep these two cranked in this current incarnation. Uh, I do have a future revision in mind that adds an extra boost stage just for adding clean output uh, 
volume, so um, hopefully that'll be less of an issue for that version, but for now, um, it sounds good, just keep those cranked, it shouldn't provide any issues, and if you do need uh, more of a lead boost, just use, uh, you know, a clean boost pedal after this. And this is a tone control. You can really hear the sting of the attack when it's all the way up, and then as you roll off the highs, it gets nice and warm. And that's about all I have to say uh, or show you for now. Um, it's a very simple circuit, but one that sounds really good. And uh, um, this isn't a prototype housing. Usually the uh, foot switch would be up a little higher because um, I'd uh, try and squeeze in room for a battery because these single uh, transistor-based circuits, uh, fuzz circuits, uh, they really like uh, having uh, battery power. But, um, you know, this enclosure was meant for something else, but I, that didn't work out, and then I realized I could fit this in, and it's sounding good. Um, future versions should have enough room for uh, batteries. Um, so yeah, this is great if you like uh, that kind of dying amp sound, like, not dying as in, yeah, not dying, but like, you know, really, really cranked up and then just riding the volume control uh, for getting cleaner sounds. Um, it's also good for people who like having a, f like the idea of having fuzz, but don't really uh, have a way of working it into their rigs, because every fuzz pedal they've tried is too bassy or wooly. Like, this has, like, you know, the similar kind of top end raspiness as a fuzz, uh, as a vintage fuzz would have, but um, none of the low end issues. It, this is very tight sounding. And, oh yeah, um, I'm not going to show you now because they need new strings, but. Uh, uh, if I were playing either my SG or Les Paul into this, uh, having humbuckers go into the front end, it would sound really nice and saturated. It'd still do the cleanup uh, thing nice, but uh, um, it, it's great for getting like those old school uh, Neil Young kind of tones, um, just humbuckers into uh, you know, cranked up tweed amp sound is uh, like a fantastic uh, guitar tone. Um, and if you can't, you know, get a Tweed Basement or a Tweed Deluxe, uh, you know, try something like this and uh, put it in front of a nice clean amp and use this for the gain and you're in uh, really raw, let's see, uh, blues and rock uh, territory there. So if you're interested in this prototype, um, I will be selling it at a lower price than um, what I plan on selling at the next revision at, just because it is the prototype. Um, you know, I'll come up with a price later, probably post it in the description here. Uh, it's, uh, but yeah, just contact me, uh, Tom Freeman Audio Effects, either, uh, Instagram or, uh, Facebook, TomFreemanAudioEffects at gmail.com to email me and let me know if you're interested. And with that... <laughs>